Hello and welcome to the next revlog. At least I'm pretty sure that it's the next revlog, but it could be not. Um, yeah, I have kung fu with my brother in a little way bit, but not yet. I say not yet. So that's all good, really. Um, but I'm also having a mannequin brought down um, ugh, to practice targeting because uh, my. Uh, Kung Fu grading, of which I'm doing a mock this upcoming Wednesday, I have um, three hand strikes. All three have to be able to be done in specific areas. I have to practice those things. There are two of them, which I'm mostly okay at now. Tiger Claw is still a bit awkward because the angle's sideways and downwards, um, and I also don't want to actually smack anyone in the face. Which is kind of the idea. They're in the middle of the face. I need to remember that. Um, yeah, I don't want to have to actually crack anyone in the face. And I need to stop about here. So I just need to go rather than all the way up past the head. Um, but leopard's paw, I'm mostly okay with. Under the nose going upwards. The fact it's going upwards is like the only awkward bit there. Throat, sternum, stomach and groin through like down the bladder and stuff. Back up again. It's Crane's beak that I struggle with. Crane's beak strike. There are 14 to do. Um, but there's seven down and seven back up again. Number one is a soft target one. So it goes in and stops. So it goes in and stops at the eye. Number two, pecks and comes out, because it's a hard area. Three, soft, four, soft, five, hard, six, hard, seven, hard. Then reverse it back up. <laughs> but, I think I can hear my granddad on the way. So, I'm going to stop recording this, and I'll catch you cats on the flip. The, the reason I was explaining that, by the way, is because the mannequins were training on, um, because it has eyes and nose and ears. But I'm ba 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 ba. Anyway, goodbye.